Hi Aquarius, I'm back. <clears throat> Sorry, number uh, part three. I don't know if it's gonna be a four, but hey, you never know. Okay. Hope y'all doing great. I had a good night's sleep. So yeah, let's see what else we need to talk about. Um, we did the plants. Let's talk about the dopamine. Um, let's turn the light on too. Yeah, so we can see. Other things that uh, mess up our brain and stop us from going to our highest potential. Uh, dopamine in the brain, I didn't know anything about this until they started teaching me as well. And that comes from uh, too much, doing too many things. And then they always told us to be busy, and that's a lie. The internet, TV, phone, gambling, drinking, smoking, sexing, people, food. Not good food. Radio, music. All kind of stuff. We don't even know how to just chill and just sit back and enjoy life. One person, uh, he suggested we just fast on just water and just enjoying Mother Nature and getting out in Mother Nature and maybe writing, you know, no noise. But as much as you can find, if you stay in the city, they make sure there's noise. But maybe getting up at a certain time or closing of the night where everything's quiet. But yeah, yeah, it makes us, uh, by having all these things we have in our brain and around us is a uh, loss of pleasure, motivation, empathy, goals, focus, got heavy metals all in us, you know, and stuff. And uh, we don't know how to be compassionate for anybody anymore. We're just watching everything on the internet and laughing at people getting hurt and abused and people robbing places and bragging about what they're doing and you know, just a rape, just crazy stuff. We just, we got to work on ourselves, y'all. So, boost it up, uh, get more sleep, probiotics. I read about probiotics. And uh, it's a bean that grows uh, for Mother Nature that helps the brain called M-U-C-U-N-A-P-R-U-R-I-E-N-S. And, um... It helps to produce dopamine in the brain, and it's also good for Parkinson's disease. And ginkgo biloba, mental performance, brain mood function, it helps also. Um, curcumin, oregano, or if I'm saying that wrong, y'all see it. Magnesium, green tea, vitamin D, fish oil, caffeine, ginjin, ginjin, G-I-N-G-E-N-G. Yeah, all those things could help us. Get our brain back, y'all. And Dr. Sabe, remember, he talked about electrical foods. And some of those plants I showed y'all had was electrical foods as well. So, yeah, it's, we have alkaline in our diet. We know nothing about this stuff. But um, he suggested we go on a plant-based diet. And y'all watch him and looking up him up. He'll tell you about a lot of plants and how to do all those things. You know, he said by having alkaline and alkaline water. It uh, rejuvenates your cells by eliminating toxic waste through alkaline in your blood so the body won't store mucus. This causes all diseases. So all these things can make our, us, you know, our blood and everything store all kind of crazy stuff. And we all blocked in the bloodline and the blood inside of our body. No functioning electricity from the head through the heart to the feet to the feet to the heart to the head. It's not flowing like it's supposed to. So he was just naming a couple of plants I wrote down. Kale, dandelions, uh, kalilo, C-A-L-L-O-L-O. -L -L -O. I'm going to look up. I'm going to try to remember to look that up. And he said no dairy at all because, you know, they already talked. Look on the internet about um, about uh, dairy products. Only milk you're supposed to have is the milk from your mother. And hopefully she's eating right, you know. And potato, no potatoes, corn. He said all oh, this is hybrid food. Tofu, right, white rice white pasta, white bread, white sugar, white table salt, you know, and then putting it in the microwave because, of, of course, you're getting it out the stores. I even asked her a question, what in the world, how did they get stores? <laughs> I tell you, yeah, I was very curious and still is. And uh, it's for control, show you what to eat, okay? But, you know, they, they take all the nutrients out because most of our food is made in laboratories. So you put it in the microwave, it's all, you just shot it. It's nothing. Then you got radiation coming in your body, and you don't know how to clean that out. You're not taking spiritual baths and 
you know, radiation cleaning and stuff. So it's time to do that, y'all. He says, TV dinners, can and box foods. We don't even know how to live without this stuff. Okay? Especially if you live around the city. Uh, so we need fresh apples. Got to see what real apples are. I'm going to look that up. Small bananas with seeds in them. Okay? Most of see them in the foreign stores. They have them in regular grocery stores, but not a lot. Berries, cantaloupe, cherries, dates, figs, grape seeds, limes, mangoes, papayas, peaches. You know? And then we go to copper. And, uh, you know, then another thing that, that messes up, they tell us about old age. I, I always said I think there was a lies. And getting old and brittle and dying, I thought that was a lie. Because the reason why they, they say that, because they're taking all the nutrients out the food. So, of course, if you don't have any copper, and copper it affects your bones, hair, skin. So, your brittle bones, hair falling out, turning gray, pain all in your body. Skin got all kind of spots and all kind of stuff growing on it. Your vision is lost, you know. You're weak, fatigued, sickness often, memory loss, learning. You don't even care about that no more. Difficult walking. You know, along with iron, enables the body to form red blood cells, maintains healthy bones, blood vessels, nerves, immune function, iron absorption. You know, all these things I've said in the front, it helps with that. Prevents cardiovascular disease and osteoporosis, pale skin, gray hair, sensitive to cold. You know, they don't tell us about this. You have to really dig deep. <clears throat> that covert thing with CO, to me, it means copper you know either they're putting it in your body or they're taking it out you know so i don't i don't know but make sure you get your blood type in order to know what foods you need to eat you know because some people can't even not even supposed to eat meat so uh if you can beef liver oysters lobsters lamb liver squid dark chocolate oats almonds uh sesame seed cashew nuts sunflower seeds mushrooms Side effects of too much copper, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, stomach ache, black stool, headaches, difficult breathing, irregular heartbeat, coma, even death, y'all. Yellow skin, low blood, kidney and liver. Someone, <clears throat> excuse me, someone mentioned that that's what they're putting in the COVID, like I said. So if you have too much melanin, which copper is the melanin, and they get, give you that shot, it could be fatal. If you have uh, none, you know, it could be fatal. If you have a little bit of balance, could save you. So this, this is kind of crazy. I don't know really what's going on. But, yeah, those are some issues that uh, we need to think about and work on. So, yeah, yeah, let's read a little bit about the um, blood type. I don't know why it's shaking like that. hope it's okay. Maybe just the glare. I'm hoping. Yeah, let's go with um, A blood type. Gets stressed easily. High level of cortisol. Cortis stress hormone. Common personality traits. Kind, shy, attentive, stubborn. Polite, tense. Reliable, overly sensitive. Perfectionist, responsible, timid. Anxious. Compose and reserve. Okay. Oh, shoot. That wasn't the first one, y'all. Yeah. Um, personality. Sensitive, cooperative, emotional, passionate, and clever. Patient, loyal, and love. Peace and do not like to get into fights with anyone. Sometimes can be oversensitive. Don't like to break the rules set by society and care about etiquette and social standards take time to make decisions and are too organized in all spheres of life but cannot multitask like neat clean place people with OCD fall into a, a blood type um, get stressed easily high level of cortisol stress hormone Common personality traits, kind, shy. Okay, we read that, didn't we? Yeah. Uh, what I do? 
best traits loyal perfectionist organized and consistent bad traits obsessive overly sensitive permit permiss permissive well be that word is stubborn easily stressed and fast fast to this reliable and trustworthy friend don't like to show their emotions and feel to anyone unless com comfortable with you um blood types india usually take a close look at a potential partner star sign to check their compatibility level japan japanese like to do things a little different use it for personality matching information uh, it's called kitsuki gate is the term which means analyzing a person's personality based on their blood type they ask your blood type uh assess the potential of employment and compatibility of two people getting married japanese go deep with it but then you got to consider um what is this hold on one second y'all Yeah. Uh, then you got to consider which one you are. Because you be A positive. You should be in a, a veg vegetarian. You should be a vegetarian because of they because of their they have less than robu robust immune system and prone to anxiety. So weight loss less disease more energy better di di digestion what happens so as so for less stress so pro no processed foods foods high in sugar simple carbohydrate fruits i'm gonna turn on the light y'all no it's already on fruits blueberries um elderberries beans legumes vegetables dark leafy greens kale swiss cardi cardi spinach garlic and onions cold water fish sardines salmon uh yeah that's for a positive organic veg vegetarian or almost veggie food plain soy protein tofu grains barley sprouted bread walnut Pumpkin seed, peanuts, olive oil. Okay. Um, chicken, little chicken, limited chicken. Okay. Turkey, green tea, ginger, protein at the st uh, start of the day. Smoothies, goat's milk, limited animal protein. Breakfast, turkey, eggs, stuff like that. Vegetables fruits and grains anytime then you got to consider are you a negative okay am i starting with that first yeah and um so drum drum and wheat refined sugar refined carbohydrates while flour bread oils other than olive oil i mean is this this right side yeah other than olive oil artificial leonard and any artificial ingredients most condemned so just olive oil you can't use artificial ingredients condemnments disease associated with this a negative cancer diabetes anxiety disorders cardiovascular disease um, avoid beef pork lamb cows milk potatoes yam sweet potatoes vegetables carriage eggplant tomatoes type of vegetables tomatoes peppers mushrooms lima beans fruits melons oranges strawberries mangoes poultry chicken turkey uh, duck virgins fish uh, bluefish uh, barracuda haddock herring catfish grains wheat Brand, multi-gram bread, 
Um, this eating could help stop reduce body mass index, BMI, blood pressure, serum, whatever that weird word is, cholesterol. So you got to consider all that type of stuff too with your blood type. That's just blood type A, okay? So yeah, uh, let me continue on the rest of them, y'all. I'm trying to see if this even, let me test it for a minute. Be right back.